we go. Boogeyman ain't my family. Spare any change for a new closet door? So this dude, he's not actually homeless. Or is he? Some homeless people, they come up with really creative signs. To get that money. In places where there's a lot of homeless people, there's a lot of competition. So your sign has to shine brighter than all the other homeless people's signs. So you get that money. It's like a thumbnail, but for homeless people. Look at this face. This is the face of a genius. I bet you can't hit me with a quarter. You think I can't do what? Yo, I'll show you. I'll show you I can hit you with a quarter. It's a win-win situation because you get to prove him wrong and he gets to keep the quarter that you hit him with. I bet people throw quarters at him all day of day. Or maybe people feel bad and they're like, hey, I don't wanna throw a quarter at this poor dude. He didn't do anything to me. Either way, he's making that money. After a hard day's work, he gonna laugh his way to a coin star in a Walmart. Available for adoption or donation. My name is Bonehead. P.S. No checks. <laughs> Would you adopt Bonehead right here? Comment below. He got some creepy eyes. Imagine this dude just coming out of your closet. I think he is the boogeyman. Some people like to offer a service. This dude's specialty is that he will pimp you for cash. So give us some cash, and he will pimp you. I don't know what he means by that. I know you could like pimp a ride, but if he pimps me for cash, wait! Does that mean he's gonna make you his hoe? That's what pimps do, he's pimping you out. So technically, you're paying him to be his hoe. Yeah, okay, I don't think so. I had to think about that for a sec. But no deal. Free sanitizer, help the homeless, donate. Free squirt. You know you want that free squirt. Wait, so it's free sanitizer. It's a free squirt. But donate if you enjoyed that hand sanitizer. You don't have to, you know, like no pressure. You're using a homeless person's hand sanitizer that he worked very hard for. No pressure, it's, it's free. You know when somebody's giving away free samples of something and you take one and you don't buy it and they give you that look like, you sure you don't want to, like, pick one up? <coughs> Costco! Cereal killer, spare change for milk? <gasps> Wait, so milk kills cereal? I know it makes it, like, soggy and everything, but... No, I like cereal. I don't want to see you kill it. Who knows what else he's killed? We got Post Malone before he was famous. Oh, uh, why are you gonna say Post Malone? Why don't you just say sausage? <laughs> we'll eat for food. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, that's right. You give him food, you better believe he will eat it. Okay, so like, if I give you any food, you would eat it? This would be fun, there needs to be more people like this. With like creative signs, I think he's doing pretty good for himself. He's gonna get free food the rest of his life. My ex-wife had a better lawyer. So that's why he's on the streets, they got a divorce, and she took everything. How could you leave your ex-mans like this? Or I guess a lot of people would want to leave their ex-mans like this. <laughs> All I have to remember her is this rug that I made into a poncho. It was in our living room and I loved it. Not homeless. Trap got raided last night. Need money to pay the connect back. Anything helps. Jesus loves you. Hashtag no hobo. This dude really gonna use a hashtag in his homeless sign. Except it's not a homeless sign because it says he's not homeless. Y'all gotta read these signs. Um. If he needs money, why doesn't he do what other people do? Get a job! Nah, some people just want the easy way. Easy, breezy, beautiful, not homeless. I mean, all you gotta do is hold up a sign and look cute. Like, I ain't even homeless though, but if you wanna like give me a dollar, I'll take a dollar. Again, we got a very professional woman. Recently laid off executive assistant. Will work for 60K a year. May I send resume? I mean, she's not even homeless or anything. She's just looking for a job. That's one way to try to find a job. At least it's not like the other guy, like, hey, I need money. She's like, yeah, I need money. But I will work for it. Hey everybody, I'll be your executive assistant, but you gotta pay up. It's gonna cost you 60k a year. She's asking for a lot. I mean, she's just asking to send her resume. I hope Margaret over here got what she was looking for. Some homeless people, they will offer you a service for some money. Good old Bill will cuss out your mother-in-law for a dollar. Only a dollar? That's the deal of a century. Here you go. If only I had a mother-in-law that I didn't like. I would give you this dollar and you could cuss her out because I know some people they really don't like their mother-in-laws If you don't like your mother-in-law call Bill. He hangs at Shell gas stations by the vacuums need money for a DNA test 
girlfriend might be sister. What the hell? You got bigger problems going on right now. Okay. <laughs> Somebody call Murray. Call Dr. Phil. Hello? Which is the one that deals with baby daddy drama? Is this kind of the same category for the baby daddy drama? I mean, if you think your problems are bad, this dude is trying to figure out if his girlfriend is his sister. <sighs> what then? Father has gone to the dark side. Need money for X-Wing to destroy the Death Star. Luke, what happened to you? Is this what happened? This is a really good sign. I would hand over my money. I don't care if you're homeless or not. This is a good way to make money. Why he look like Owen Wilson though? Wow. Hollywood ain't paying you enough. My father was killed by ninjas. Need money for karate lessons. <gasps> oh no, this poor guy. How did the ninjas just kill him and get away with it? Come, my child. I will, I will train you. I will train you in the ways of the kung fu. We'll get them ninjas one day. Somebody please buy this dude karate lessons. When you gotta go to ballet practice at two, but you homeless at three. What happened? And they will dance for food. What the hell happened to them? How they hit rock bottom so hard, how they do it together. I would give them some food. <gasps> they got sock puppets and everything. I bet they're racking in hella money. Who would see two ballerinas and not give them a burger? I would even get them an in and out double double. Maybe some animal style fries if they ask nicely. Sometimes you just gotta read their sign. Like this girl. All I need is weed. At least she's honest. So you know exactly where your money is going. I like how she's gonna post for this. She's like, I ain't homeless. I got a nine to five job. I got good parents who pay for my education. But I need some of the devil's lettuce. She knows how to get stuff for free. This guy's sign says penny or a smile. Wow, he's actually not asking for much. So either smile at him or give him a penny. Only a penny? Come on, what are you gonna do with a penny? Wow, this message is so inspirational! Okay, not, not that inspirational. So inspirational, I gotta mess up my hair for it. I would give this guy some money. I feel like he's a good person for this sign. He wants you to smile. Maybe it like brightens his day or something. I feel like this is so sweet. I would give him way more than a penny. You gotta set your standards up a little higher. Out luck, need buck. You know what rhymes with buck? Luck, <laughs> and he ain't got either one. Would you give him a buck, or would you give him some luck? If he gets lucky, does that count as luck? Out of luck, need a buck, maybe even a buck. I'm kidding. We'll code HTML for food, please help. <gasps> this is actually so sad. So many people go to college, get an education for what? To be homeless? To be asking to code HTML for food? What the hell? Somebody give this dude some food. Get him a job too. That honestly sucks. Like go to college, get an education for what? I feel like this is very relatable to a lot of people I went to school with. They all out here struggling. Obama ain't the only one who wants change. Wow, he has so much in common with Obama. Except y'all want different change. Give him some money. So maybe one day, he could be the president of the United States. Nah, man, I just want change. Oh. I spent all my money on cardboard and a marker. Now, why would you go and do that? There hasn't been a more honest man. His face is so red. So I can make this sign, and people will give me money so I don't have to work for it. Great logic. This guy. Yeah, you. We got another one of these geniuses. I'll bet you one dollar you'll read this sign. Oh, shit. Okay, I read it, so... Here you go, you win this bet. If people actually played by these rules, you kinda have to give them the dollar. You read the sign, fair and square, hand over the dollar. I kinda wanna do this now. I wanna just like go out in public with the same exact sign and see if people will give me a dollar. But I feel bad about taking money from people. But it's like, I don't even have to be homeless or anything. You don't know if he's homeless. You don't know if he's making six figures. You don't know his life. You don't know any of these people's lives. Do a good video. <gasps> what is this? So cute, baby. Oh, look what sausage got me. How cute. Some people just see homeless people sitting on the corner of the street. And then they're like, here's the crispy $1 bill. And they don't even read the sign. See, like this dude. Need petrol for my Porsche. 
He needs gas money for his Porsche. What the hell? You tell me this guy has a Porsche and he's sitting here with a napkin asking for money? Nah, he's just lazy. Maybe sell the Porsche and then you could buy gas. Oh my god, I know, genius. You don't know these people's lives. Anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment below which one was your favorite and which one would you actually give money to. If you want a part two, make sure you hit that like button in the face and subscribe to the Wolf Pack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.